Hello there and welcome. That, we've had a little break here on Craft Extra. We're we back from yeah. on all cylinders. We are indeed. Oh, um, about that. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're going to be here for the next two hours, and I'm fortunate position to be that I'm spending the next hour with you, lovely ladies. Lovely, lovely. <laughs> had a very busy hour earlier on we the did. main yes. channel. Yes, yes, yeah. everybody. Yeah, yeah, we did. And that yeah. was 9 a.m. this morning. Was yes, it? yes, yeah. yeah. So you can That's go brilliant. back and watch that show. Sell lights as well. Yeah, yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. So it's going to be a busy one. So my advice to you is to little yeah. have a little look on the website and perhaps make your purchases um, early. Um, and uh, if you want, if you are watching us online, then obviously you'll have all the products that are appearing. But um, it's useful to know how you can shop with us here on Craft Extra. So on the website, all you need to do is go to um, at the top. You can see that little kind of schedule. It's that little um, calendar, isn't it? Click on there, and that will give you the opportunity to watch the different kind of tabs that we've got. The main channel, and there we are. Craft Extra. Now we do have shows on Craft Extra throughout the day, but obviously we only have four live hours a day. This one being the current one, and there's another one in an hour's time. And you can see all of the fabulous goodies that the ladies have bought to, um, to us. But I have to say, my goodness, Kay, look at those five star reviews. Yeah, well, yeah. we make stuff that people like. Exactly. <laughs> and I think this is a key thing, isn't it, Maggie? That you crafters, so you understand yeah, our, how it all our comes together. Is yeah, that'll do won't do yes and we yeah. are we are brutal in our design process we're horrible to each other but it has <laughs> to work and you have to have confidence if we True. use something um you have to have confidence Absolutely. that yes when you get it home yeah. you and make the most of it comes to the fact that we can't find it yes yes so you can't uh, if, 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 if it was already out there well why bother yeah but it's not already out there yeah, yeah. yeah. and it's why isn't it out yeah. there because it should be yeah. exactly <laughs> there you go it is yeah, exactly yeah. so we've got loads of fabulous things to show we've got dyes we've got tools that are going to help you yeah. as well and um, we've got some fabulous demonstrations you're coming up with the first demonstration yeah and i'll be at the demo showing you how things work so i'll just go off and do that maggie we're going to have a chat about we're going to wander down okay and i'll see you in a minute i'll catch up with you in a minute then so so we have got a fabulous collection of lots of different tools and this is the key thing tools are things that we will use for many many years yeah. to come yeah including the fabulous dies yes. that we've got yeah and okay. this is brilliant so, so our dies are um slightly different probably to everybody else's okay so how are um, they different they're different because we do things that are um they're slightly wider to start with so they're not so thin as other okay. dies anyway but we also design them so that they're long-lasting workhorses they're not fashionable okay once you've got them you've got them they'll work with all our other designs they'll also work with other companies designs okay. as well um, a lot of our dies have alignment notches on so right. you can it makes it easier easy, yeah. to get them aligned straight um and then we've designed things that usually have more than one purpose so when you look at this first one here okay the dimensional pocket die yes. um this has a quarter of an inch um little band all the way around so okay. that's that's the depth of your pocket right. and the big die that you can see actually cuts out to hold an ephemera card four inches by three inches that's a good okay size, yeah which yeah. is a traditional yes, yeah, album yeah. making size but then you see the two little bits at the bottom yes which Kay designed, Kay designed this die, um, and they're designed so that you can make a dimensional pocket of any size you choose. Oh, right, And she okay. showed that this morning, she said to Dan, which she was doing a six by four, and she said, what do you want, portrait or landscape? And he said, portrait. So she just she did, it there and then. did it there and then. You will get a little tiny um, instruction sheet in with this die, okay. which shows you how to work out the measurements if you want to use the little tiny bits on the own. I but love Kay it. did an amazing demo this morning. Absolutely. And you've got these fabulous little um, pockets, which are so, so sweet. Yeah. Obviously, at the front, it looks beautiful. You've got fabulous little kind of ATC on there, but you've got the depth with these. Yeah. And it, this is the key thing. You've got that recess. So if you're wanting to pop something in there, it's very easy for you to do so. Yeah. And if you look at the back again, if you hold it up, you can see the beautifully mitered corners. Absolutely. That's and that's perfection. all part of the... Um, construction from yeah, the die, yeah. and it gives it that it kind of reinforces those corners and kind yes. of gives it the stability gives it as the well. Stability and strength as well. Now I have to say that is a very clever technology there. But they, I love this idea of making these little miniature yeah. frames. Yeah, Kay's made a little miniature frame with that. And are you doing that at three o'clock? Yeah, that one, so, yeah. yeah. And the um, plant in the middle. I love this. It's so with dainty. The little tiny cheese plant leaves. They're from our other range of dies that we've just started doing for okay. miniatures, and we do dies that are for a scale of 1 to 12 and 1 in 24. So those are kind of like doll's house kind of dolls scales. Dolls house, right. but we can things like that, yeah. 
perfect. So everything's been designed. And I've those, not seen again, those yeah, yet. So they, they, we brought them last month. They went bananas, yes, didn't yes, it? Yes, oh, right, well, I can uh, imagine. So, and there's lots of things in the pipeline. Absolutely. I love it. So do check those out as well. Got loads of finished samples there. Yes, we here. have. Because obviously I was showing you the original one there um, a few moments ago. It's uh, narrower than the one that we've got here. So again, it's the same kind of technology making yeah. it to whatever size Kay's you like. got a brilliant sample here as well. Oh, have you? Oh, let's have a quick look then. So what have you got over there, Kay? I've got, um, I've got uh, a one in an album. So it's a dimensional pocket in an album with our special oh, wallets wow. inside it. So that's so that's done to a completely different size. So I think it looks like a six by, by four, or slightly yeah. bigger. So she's made that, um, this is Linda's album, and she's just made that as a pocket as a, in front of the page. So well, it's just showed. basically one page, and you just just got that is just that and shows just, the versatility, yeah. doesn't it? So yeah. Yeah. Make yeah. whatever size you like, and then they're holding our photo wallet die, which got is those coming dice up next. That was coming up with yeah. it, yeah. Okay, yeah, yeah. And, and then obviously the photo ones, then you can put your photos. In there Lovely. As well. the wallets. So there you go. So if you're wanting to create your um, three-dimensional pocket, then uh, you've got your three dies coming to you for just seventeen pounds and nine pence. A wise investment of anybody's money, especially mm -hmm. if you're into your memory albums. Then yeah, yeah it's worth its yeah. weight, isn't but it? But it's that brilliant one? for you know if you just want dimensional on, dimension on your cards and things like that. Yeah, um, it's all there. All the hard work's been done for you. I love it. There you go. And don't forget, mm. you can go back to nine o'clock this morning and actually see that in action if you're wanting to. So if you want that one four nine one at four seven five you've been very good company it was a very popular diet this morning so uh, yeah by all means you can get hold of that one i will warn you though over half of the stock has gone so uh, over on craft extra sometimes you kind of get an opportunity to kind of uh, bag those deals before we go back onto the main channel at three yeah because so, yeah. they've had all our Oh, I don't know if I'm supposed to say that, but they've had all our stock level now. Well, that's so. it. <laughs> it's too late. For the, for the dies, yeah. yeah. So, yeah. So, you need to, yeah, so don't leave it until later because you could miss out on it. But moving on, saw those fabulous photo wallets popping into that fabulous um, pocket. And that's what we've got here a set of two dies. And they're kind of um, spaced that They're coming one wallet, though, don't they? But you yeah, space it's them out to four, show four dies you get. Right. Yeah. Oh, yes. I'm just yeah. referring to yeah, two boards. Um, yeah. But yes. So this it all is comes a, in one wallet. It comes in one wallet. This is a big die set. It'll only go through your larger die cutting machine. Okay, fair enough. Um, the actual base die, which is that one. Lovely. Let me hold that up. Um, you can tell us about that. That actually fits exactly on a piece of um, UK A4 card. Oh, okay. okay. So a standard A4 card, that fits on exactly. You and cut can, it through. I can see it's putting in some um, fold lines It does lines the school there. lines for you. That it has little the little... Cut opening out. there yes. what's the word Kate? cut out, cut out yes cut out. Sorry, I'm, I'm having problems this morning remembering <laughs> okay. i always refer it to it as a smile because yeah. it's like a little it smile is. yeah <laughs> yeah, yeah. so yeah. That, that's your base one lovely okay and then you get three additional dies on top of Let that. Me do it that way around there we go so this one cuts your paper that will fit on top of the smile so these so are the decorative elements the decorative now elements. okay okay this one in the middle here that actually cuts out your rectangular shape there, but it's got, if you look, you can see. Yeah, you can it's see got those little, tiny photo little cut, corners. Cutting yeah. corners there. That's, they work in conjunction with our cut in photo slot dies that we do, right. all sorts of things. Um, so that's a, you can actually use it as a standalone piece as well. Okay. And then that's your mat for the front flap. I love that folds it. over. So if we bring so them all together, you can see you've got a comprehensive set that's going to give you everything that you need to create those fabulous wallets. And they sit beautifully within that pocket that we saw they a few do. moments ago they with Kay. Do. And Kay's got another fabulous sample that <laughs> Lynn did that shows you how you can make an album just okay. using this. Oh, this, and this, this, this one is literally used the photo of wallets as pages. Oh, just those? Yep. So you just open it up. And we've got this on our blog, how to do this. Oh, um, okay. So, so how do we find the blog? Where, if you go onto that? our website and go onto the home page, right. and then the top bar, there's lots of things that say workshops, other things, click on blog, and Perfect. you'll have to scroll through because we've got some amazing it's ones on there. there. <laughs> In fact, we've got an amazing chicken coop there at the moment oh, as well. It's, it's just gone up. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yes, it's fab. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Sorry, so, yeah so, so anyway, the entire album is made out of um, photo wallets. That is lovely. So, yeah. so you can use them as, as pages. And they're brilliant all, all for um, really nice wedding invitations, things like Good that. Actually, yes, yes. Um, everything that's got the surprise. We were talking about surprise and travel. You know, you're going on a holiday, you mm -hmm. open it up, here's where your destination is. You can do yes. all sorts of things with it. Absolutely. But it's a die you will use. <laughs> 
over and over Actually, again. It's one of our most popular yeah. ones. So we order it in, but we have to wait a while before we order it, no. because it's such a big guy. No, no, that's, that's um, understandable. And for <laughs> anybody that's watching, if they're looking at actually doing this, Kay, mm -hmm. do they need an additional die to create the spine for them to attach to? Uh, for was this? With, yeah. Uh, no, no, not, not, not necessarily. No, no, you don't necessarily need a die okay. to create no, the spine. No, you can use our spine score guide or yeah, the scoreboard. Yeah. You, yeah. Or you need a score, um, scoring mat. Yes, so you don't yeah. need necessarily anything else, but um, Maggie showed earlier on how to use our score guide, yeah. which was Perfect. brilliant. Make it, look, make it easy. There you go. Yeah. So if you do want to get that effect, just keep an eye open for those. But the little mm. wallets themselves, I think anybody that's doing like an awards evening, you can always oh, imagine oh, yes. the nominations, uh, nominations are, and then you're opening it up. <laughs> <laughs> that's a brilliant idea. Oh, I think it'd be brilliant. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I've got um, a, a hen weekend that I'm organising for my, mm -hmm. my future daughter-in-law to be, and I think that'd just be fabulous. It's almost that like little yes. task or yes, challenges is, or something it? like and that and your job for the day is exactly yes, there yeah. you go i love Brilliant. it really good size but we've got some fabulous um, oh this is pretty i like this it's done like a little backpack oh, lynn's done this as well this so that's a little backpack that that she's done that's you. our buckle die which i'm not sure if we've got any in the brand shop okay but then when you open it up oh look at that inside that is so clever and then you've got more more of your little wallets more in there, there like that and we've so also got, uh, we'll see more of these appearing when we get um, a little bit further along the counter as well, because we've got a fabulous little box that they fit in, yes. which um, is kind yeah. of almost like little recipe elements that you mm -hmm. could be putting in there as well. So brilliant idea. So if you're wanting to create your own little wallets, then the details are on your screen. Well, they're not little wallets, they're sizable, aren't they? £26 and nine pence, brilliant value for money. So all of those dies coming together and of course loads of inspirations from the ladies. So do check out their blog for ideas of how to use them. 662970. It's nice we're actually seeing how these work because when you actually look at the mm. dies it's yeah, nice think, to relate them to Kay we, and what she's we doing. We forgot to say as well that all our dies have YouTube tutorials Oh right! and I know with the photo wallet there's a certain Mr Lang Ford, Lang Ford. congratulations Paul, <laughs> uh, who's just done a lovely video using our Fabulous. photo wallet as well. There you go, so check it out. Oh I'm going to these. Bless you. Oh, no, I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> it's a skill. It's a skill. It's just stopping impressive. it at that moment. Very impressive. Now, moving on, we've got another die set for you. And I love this one. I love working with circles. There's something about a yeah. circle. It's just very kind yeah. of satisfying. Yeah. But so difficult for you to actually cut yeah. these out, especially yeah. in this scenario. Yeah. So this is part of our, again, we talk about our cutting photo slot dies. Okay. We do square ones, rectangular ones, and we were asked to do circle ones. So the idea of a cut-in photo slot means they cut into the paper, they don't cut the circle out. Okay. Decorative paper is lovely, but you lose a lot of it. It's very expensive and That's you true. want to see as much as you can. You also want the opportunity to be able to change the pictures Okay. if you want to, yes, if someone's yeah. upset you or you want to, <laughs> you know, your child's got grown up and you want a different picture in there. That's a nice so, idea. But you can also use them for card making. Okay. So here Kay's made a lovely card here. And she, okay. The, the dies so, cut the little tabs. So the dies cut the little tabs. Okay. And then you get the That's matching clever. dies that cut the circles that fit inside. Ah. And then Kay's made this as a shaker card. She's put seeds inside I there. That's a lovely so, idea. So you can plant things in your garden. It's a lovely idea as long as they're not weeds. Are they weeds? No, they're the here? wildflowers. <laughs> oh, well, that's all right. Yes, wildflowers. Yes, yes. never weeds. Yes. Never weeds. <laughs> I love that so. idea. What a brilliant idea. It's a brilliant idea. Isn't it, isn't just, it? Yeah. yeah. Absolutely fabulous. So there you go. If you fancy getting hold of that little set, obviously they slot back in there. But um, we've got other things to show you, so I'll do that in a Kay's second. Kay's got a oh, she'll, yeah, she'll yeah, show you yeah. how, how they work in, yeah, in an album. So in an album, so so you can use she's used the largest one on this this page, and then you can take this out and because they cut in. You see, the pa paper's the not paper's damaged. Got like yes, that's so, so clever. So if you then decide you want to put something else on there, you can do. Yeah, yeah. It could always be like the seasons of the year or something yeah. like that. Yeah. 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 Oh, so, so, idea. yeah. So you've done that, and then she's done the same on the other side as a matching one on the on the. And there are other right. sizes of available. Yeah, there's, there's other there's, shapes. There's three. Say. There's just Thr in there's this three. set. There's just three circles. Okay. okay. The other sets that we do are squares and rectangles. Okay. They're designed to hold six by four, seven by five, and so they're out of stock at the moment. We're expecting them in beginning of next week. So um, when we've got them back in, we'll bring some back here this as well. Is the thing. We struggle to keep your, your dies and yeah. your tools in stock, yeah. don't we? So, uh, yeah. Love it. So, so there you go. For now, you can get hold of the circles and you've got your three different sizes there. And of course, you've got your complete circle that will work alongside your little kind of tabbed type one there. So a 641740. Again, a brilliant value for money. So definitely one to go for. 
but we're moving on to the realms of MDF. And these work brilliantly alongside many of the things that we've spoken yeah. of already. Yeah. Um, we've got different sizes. Now, the first size that we've got, this was kind of the original size, mm -hmm. and then the others have kind of come on the back of customer requests. Yes, they have. Which yeah. I love. Yeah. So what have we so got here? So this is our 6x4 um, photo storage box. OK. And designed by Kay. So it's beautifully, and beautifully it's engineered. It's when you fit our MDF together, it'll fit together beautifully. Okay. We recommend that you don't um, paint anything or decorate anything before you assemble it because our tolerances are tight. And you can see that this holds our photo wallet die perfectly. Absolutely. Um, but it's brilliant for if you wanted to have a different <laughs> photo wallet, new baby. So for each month, you could have pictures for like, Jan, you know, that's month really one, month nice, two. Yeah. And that's like your special first year baby box. Absolutely. So you could do really nice things Talking with about it. little babies, who's this character that we've got on the screen? Oh, that's Rara. Oh, And she is, she is a Rara. Oh, she, mm. I love it. Yes. I love the fact yeah. that one velvet cushion is not enough. No, it's not. <laughs> that's actually the heirloom cushion as well. It's known as an heirloom. It used to be my mum's. Um, oh. So we, we call it the heirloom cushion. Well, she looks very comfortable She does. There. Yeah. Absolutely. And these are brilliant as well, just for, for organisation. I'm thinking as well, sometimes people will have um, kind of little uh, wallets for uh, months of the year with yes. birthdays yes. in there all yeah. it's a place to put birthday cards for people yes. later in yeah. the year and things like yeah. that so brilliant idea now the actual box itself obviously that's what we're referring to rather than the photo wallets although you can get that die as well so the box itself then this is going to come to you in its mdf form which you're going to be able yeah. to put together <coughs> and then decorate in whichever way that you like Kay's going, are you doing that first Kay? that? yeah i'm doing that one yeah, i'm doing that one. Oh, to do this first so the hinge mm. on the back is using our um professional book binding cloth are on. That makes a difference, doesn't yeah, it? And it, it? It's just like a seamless finish. So that one's the one that's not been decorated. This one's been decorated and the tape is actually... It's almost a part yeah. of this, isn't it, when yeah. you see there? You, you but it's know. really strong because it's Absolutely, cloth. Absolutely, yeah. And it um, means that, that you're not going to lose that lid, no, are you? I mean, no, I love that scenario that you've got there as well. Um, incidentally, we have got the um, the tape available for you in a couple of different widths, but you do get it within the kit, don't with you? The, within the kit, you get your black, you get your, you enough. get enough, you get, you don't so you get don't. the exact amount, you always get a little bit more in case you... Just in case. But it's very, very sticky. Okay. So if you've got long hair, keep it tied back. If you have cats that like to help you, keep them out of the way because it's very <laughs> sticky. good advice. So there you go. That is the original size. I mean, look at that for a price, eight ninety nine. But also look at that. It's got green band on there. It's limited in stock. So please do not miss out on this one. Fabulous idea. Maybe as an upcoming gift for somebody, you could be making this up. If you've gone for the wallet die as well, I mean, you could be making somewhere that they can all organized photos and things like that which I think is a brilliant idea mm. as well so that's the original size but then you asked for a larger size well the customers customers asked Paul Cat said can we have more we said yes you can have a bigger size so a little bit of muttering from Kay um, <laughs> and the 5x7 box appeared I so it's it. exactly the same concept puts together exactly the same way you get architect with this as well um, and Mary Ann's made a lovely sample here as a recipe, recipe box recipes. you can see it's edged with gold oh, that's sorry. actually using the gold pebbia markers we've put we've put them back okay. in the brand shop we've restocked it so you've got the gold the silver and Perfect. the fat black we call it there's a wider one yes yeah, yeah. Um, and they are brilliant in that scenario because they're yeah. just the right they're width so aren't they good. Yes. they're really yeah. deep they're really um, intense color and they're light fast I love it. And is this using the photo wallet again that no, you've got I, within here? Is this I, a different uh, die? Because it would be slightly larger. I'm not, not entirely sure. Uh, no, I think Marianne just cut those to fit. Oh, I see. That's fair enough. So but to be fair, I think that the, the wallets yeah. would fit in there. You've just got a bit of wiggle room, haven't yes, you? Yes, so, you yeah. have. Yeah. Um, like it. Again, this particular one is going to come in its kind of raw form. So you're going to add your decoration. It's going to come with the tape in there as well. So, of course, you're going to be able to create that hinge that we've looked at. And this time, you're just looking at £9.89. So if you want something just a slightly larger, then this is the one for you. Five by seven. Um, perfect opportunity for you to store your photos in there or mini albums as well. But nice size, that one. So why not? treat yourself to that one put together in the same way so when we see yes. the demo yep. it's going to cross and over again to there's a demo on youtube as well perfect yep. love it but for those big memories and i love a memory box i've got mm. them with the kids and i've got the like the little bands from yes. their wrists and yeah. the, their first socks and things like yep. that yeah and it's lovely to have a, a safe place for those to be it is and you know they'll be safe in there absolutely so. now yep. um a little bit of news on this one it did sell out earlier on in the live show at 9 a.m this morning over on the main channel we have got more stock of the is available it's the second of may which isn't too long to wait no. it's only about a week or so yeah. isn't it yeah, yeah. If, we, if we can get them out quicker as all as we always say we will do oh that's good um, to know 
It's, we can cut as fast as our machine can cut. Well, that's, so, that's we don't true, can't do it any sooner. Through. No. And this is beautiful. I mean, on this occasion, you've got a wedding box. Now, it could be getting ready for a wedding, a wedding planning box. It could, it could be box. for your hen party planning Absolutely. box. Absolutely. Yes. Mind you, with the photos, we might need a considerably bigger box. <laughs> <laughs> I think there's going to be a will lot you, going on. We need a padlock on it as I well. I think we probably will. Now, this so is beautiful because you've got Lynn's gorgeous papers on this, here, yes. um, as you can see. Yep. Now, there's something quite clever about the lid. So I'm going to remove the lid on this particular one. And this is the key thing. You've almost got a lip there to make yes, sure that it, yep. it sits there solid yep so when you get the kit home again Kay is going to demonstrate this but on the lids right in the center you'll see a little tiny hole okay on both pieces and that's so it's easy to align so up we'll align the top that that yep. square with the, the square yep. that's underneath and okay. also the, you've then got a, a hole there if you want to put a button on or that's a something nice else idea. like that and it's clever because yeah, it actually so it means won't. that it keeps in place there so yep. it's not going to slide around which I love um, and we have got one of the boxes waiting to be decorated down at the front and you can see on the top there that little location hole that you were just talking about yeah. Yeah, that's Another. a good word, location hole. <laughs> <laughs> well, I've got loads of words. Ooh. Yeah, uh, borrow well, that's because you do Wordle every day. Yeah. <laughs> I do, actually. Yeah. Actually, I've not done it today, I don't oh. think. So there you go, it's reminding me. Um, now, if you fancy getting hold of any of the boxes, obviously the details have all popped up on your screen. Just bear in mind, this particular one is on your extended delivery. And it's probably a good idea to jump onto the website, to be fair, because there's lots of other things that we've not had a chance to share with you. And, of course, if you want more of the tape, that is where you will find those. I'm going to head down and meet up with our lovely Okay, so Maggie can put her feet up for a little while. Yeah, yeah, we will yeah. see her a little bit later on though because she's got demos planned. And yeah. as you can see there, everything that we have been chatting about is there. Now, if you are watching and you've invested in any of these dyes or the MDF or have things that you want to share with us, you can still get involved even though we're over here on Craft Extra. So email in studio at createandcraft.com and I'd love to know what you think about your Cool Cats pro um, products because I know that everybody loves everything that you bring. Thank you. Everything's on purpose for you. Don't just make it for make it sake. No, no, it, it needs to have a purpose. Yeah, exactly, and we yeah. can't do something, so we need to do something that will do it. Perfect. And that's the reason why Absolutely. that's yeah, everything. So, so what we're looking at first. Right, I'm going to put it together. This is the um, uh, six by four box, the smaller oh, so box, the, the smaller, the smaller, little, smaller yeah. photo box. No problem. Now, we always say put together before you decorate. Okay. So, so I've obviously broken that rule. Yeah, yeah, have. I didn't like to draw attention <laughs> to it, but. <laughs> so what I've used on here was I, I cut these out for the demonstration and there was a few marks on there so I thought well so we'll hide those shall we we'll make we'll it look pretty so we've got the pens I think all right sure the oh, other on the brand okay, on, on the, on yes. the thing so I've, I've coloured them with the pens now the pens dry quite quickly and they don't over wet the MDF well, this is it because paint can add an extra it, dimension yeah, and it's, can't it it swells it, yeah. the MDF and it doesn't, doesn't, doesn't retract water, yeah and yes. it doesn't retract back again so hence the reason why you do it after generally Very so nice. we'll find out whether it works oh, we? so they'll go together this. then no it doesn't I'll, I'll have to do <laughs> Hold, just in case. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so so, that, so you've got your base piece, you've got your um, back piece, front piece, and then your side pieces. Okay. Okay, so I'm just going to literally put those together, and the, the time takes is taping it together and gluing it. Okay. It, actually, putting it together is very short, so I tend to put tape on. So, so what sort of tape do you so use? So this is our tiger tape, and it's Ooh, repositionable. Tiger tape? Yeah, it's our ti tiger tape. So this is repositionable tape, and it doesn't mark surfaces and it's very good on delicate surfaces as well <coughs> for papers and what have you so i tend to put my all right so i've got some tape ready and then got bits of tiger tape everywhere uh, yeah <laughs> so what i tend to do is i do this in one go and so if any, if you get interrupted halfway through ignore whatever it is because you don't want to answer the phone because you, your glue will go off oh that's a good point so so what i do i, I put a glue on all the inner bits so all the recessy recessy bits okay I put a little bit of glue. All the inny bits. All the inny bits. Not the anti bits. Yeah, yeah the inny bits. <laughs> and I'm using, in this case, I'm using our um, book binding glue, which is oh, a good quality okay. PVA. Um, you can use any good quality PVA or a wood glue. Okay, so or I'm guessing because of the, the, the better MDF. quality, you've got less water content, is yeah. that right? You need, you need a fairly, and it, and it grabs reasonably quickly as well, okay. otherwise it doesn't grab, and it, you, do, you do need to grab. So I tend to do every, all of these in one go, which is a time-consuming bit. This is a bit that's 
I can't really hurry because it's. No, no, but I think it's I important can't do it in advance. to see. That's one of the luxuries that we have here on Craft Extra that we can take that time with the demos. So it's always worth keeping an eye open. And we have four live shows over on Craft Extra most days, um, except for weekends. Um, and you can always join us. It's 10 a.m. through till 12. Um, sometimes it's a double hour show, sometimes they're two different kind of uh, themes. Um, and that's what we've got this afternoon. So kick things off again at 1 o'clock with this hour. And then um, the hour after this one, we've got an hour with David. Um, and the Minecraft Studio um, <laughs> bundle that we've got for you. So, yeah, nice mix. Uh, I like that yeah, extra. Good. Yeah. Well, you, there's some interesting demonstrations on it. Yeah, there? very much so. Very much so. so. Lovely. So just work your way through that, man. I've noticed as well you've bit. kind of got the fine detail nozzle on this you one as well. You don't need that so. much. You only need a little bit of glue. So yeah. I've got the fine one, so I'm just going doing a line. But if I had, if I used one of the bigger bottles, which is mm -hmm. that one, I'll do tappy method. Little dabs. Yeah, yeah. little dabs. Yeah. That makes sense. Maggie Court refers it to as my um, woodpecker technique. <laughs> Can you imagine, yeah. Pe 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but you, you yes. need to say the glue is it's just enough, which yes. sounds a ridiculous thing to say, but it's. Well, I, I suppose you don't mind it. It dries clear, but you don't want it to kind of ooze out no, either. No, it do just you? makes a mess. Yeah. And you, yeah. you, you, and you can avoid it. doing that. So I'm going to start putting it together. Need. So I'm afraid you might not be able to see this, but I'm going to put that together. Okay, so is that the, the base? That you're that's a, yeah, I'm attaching everything to the base. Okay. So that's, that's the side. So of course, that this is the base, isn't it? That's yeah. the side, yes. Okay, and that fits in like that. Okay, and then what I'm going to do is put the... It's very logical, actually, the way that it comes together. Well, the idea is that when we design it, that's the, yeah. Yeah, it's got to be easy to put together. Yeah. Ah, oh, now the tape's come around. That's yes. clever. So that comes into that. So it keeps everything nice and square. Yes, hence you've got a good supply of that ready. Yeah. So let's do this one. So because you, so, you're just wiggling it around just just a tad you just want to make sure you do this in one go and you've got so. a bit of wiggle room haven't you before it actually kind of yeah, locks so together that, and glues so right there and then you turn this one over to make it a bit easier and it just slots on top absolute per perfection with yeah, the engineering and the cuts well that's what we spent our time doing yeah because you know I, I quite like putting things together but Quite frankly, I don't want to put something together that involves putting sanding it. Yes, quite yeah. Because fr quite frankly, what I've, we've all had kits. Yeah, MDS, you have to it. kind of wiggle them and adapt them. Haven't yes, you? Yeah. and you're thinking it's really frustrating. Yeah, I totally agree. Okay, Look at that. that is done. Okay, so I'll just put that off one side, that and then is we, brilliant. now we do as the lid. Quick as that. Except, but it would be more helpful if I'd actually done it the right way around. <laughs> oh, I didn't even notice that. <laughs> I, never mind, but I'll kind of cover that later. <laughs> <laughs> that's because I wasn't concentrating on what I was doing. That's I think I just covered right. the wrong side, but never mind. Okay, we'll see, we'll so see if this one works. So that's the base, but of course, the lid. I suppose if you wanted to, you could leave that open if yeah. you wanted to. If you, you didn't yeah, put you the could, lid on there. Do, yeah. but of course, it does come with a lid, so we might as well make it. Exactly. So that goes like that. So we'll find out if I've done the same mistake on this one. And I suspect I probably have, but never mind. But we'll see how it goes. Oh, well, so I don't think there's an issue. And again, it's the same technique is taping it. And, and gluing it, so it's exactly the same. I'm just doing both sides. I'm only doing one. Okay. I won't do the um, the seven by five. But what no, I will no, do is, but I'm going to show you how to put the lid on the seven by five. Ah. So how to how to, put, how to put, use the tape on it. So Fabulous. you've got the hinge lid. lid. So it's a sim I, so similar sort of idea. So I have plenty of tape at the ready. Um, the tiger tape. Have we got the tiger tape in stock? It should be on the brand sh brand store. It should be okay. on the brand store. So, Wonderful. So yeah. you can add that in. And it's um, brilliant for your albums as well. So absolutely, anything. Yeah. It's really good stuff. And also, of course, with Cat P and P, you can add other goodies into your basket as well. So it's a perfect opportunity for you to stock up on your adhesive to get your fabulous um, arche is it archival tape? Archival, that you call archival, it? archival, archival tape. Yeah, the, the, uh, our bookbinding tape. We um, haven't tape. got a lot of that bookbinding tape, and you will see it in this demonstration. So if it's something that you're thinking, oh, actually, I've got something else I could use that with, do have a little look. There's two different widths of it, but not huge quantities of those. Um, so you've got the narrower one, which is your 30 mil, which I think is what's included within the kit, is it, the you, 30 you get mil? A stri you get a strip of the 30 yeah, mil, yeah. yeah. So if you're wanting to get more of that, um, and it's a really strong tape, very sticky, so you know it's going to keep everything together. And I know it's, again, one of those things that we do struggle to actually keep in stock. And I know we've not got huge quantities. Um, it's single figures, almost, with regards to these so if you are thinking to yourself right I'm going to tune in at three o'clock and place my order for it you might be a little bit too late so this is your 30 mil so this is the one that um, you will get a strip of that actually included within your kit and I'll just pop the 50 mil down for a moment so um, it's a gorgeous blue tone air force blue it's lovely it's a really nice blue isn't it yeah, it really is I, love that. Yeah. I use a lot of blue when I'm crafting
crafting, so that's yeah, and, and, yeah. And, and it's quite a nice neutral. Yes. so it will go with yeah. it a lot, yeah. a lot of other colours. Um, is it a nice one? Five pounds and thirty-nine pence. Now, within the actual kit that you get, you will get black, the black version of this on. But I think the black version is sold out. We haven't got that one available for you at the moment. Nothing I don't you can do think. with it. You can put it through an embossing folder. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Before, obviously, before you take uh, before you take the tape off. Yes. <laughs> oh gosh, yeah. It'll be there but, forever. But yeah, otherwise. but it embosses beautifully, <laughs> and then you can and put a bit of gilding wax on it just to highlight it. Lovely. Now the yeah. fifty millimeter. So if you're wanting to go for the fifty mil, this one's slightly wider. Again, it's that gorgeous Air Force blue, as you can see. And again, you're going to get a five meter length. So it's a really good length that you've got with regards to that one. But it is limited in stock. So this is the more vulnerable of the two. Um, so if your heart's set on the five millimeter, sorry, fifty millimeter, five centimeters then this is the one that you need to be getting sooner rather than later. And again, it's got that sticky backing on there as well. So, yeah. In fact, I mean, this is going to go a long way if you're just using a, a small run to... to oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yes, yeah. yeah. it, it, it does last a while. Yeah, yeah, yeah you get... Yeah, you get five metres is quite a lot. Yeah, yeah. Very much so. Yeah. Right. Sorry, I'm not keeping up. Where have we well, got well, to? Well, well, I'm doing exactly the same as I before, so I, I thought I'd just get on with it. No, that's fine. <laughs> no, it's always a good idea when I'm on shift. <laughs> so the so, front going. So the front goes on to, to that. So now you've come back. I've actually, yeah, I thought I had. Yeah. Oh, because so, all the dark have been on the right. Yeah, I see, yeah. Yeah. So what I've done. Oh no, that's right. No, that's right. That is right. It takes a while to kind of think yeah. about it, really, doesn't yeah. it? <laughs> obviously, obviously, did it yesterday. So that, so that now is they're done. So that's it. Okay. So I've got the, the base, obviously wrong way round, but never mind. That's okay. And then, Don't worry. And then um, the um, yeah, I'll, I'll put it on back, back, back to never mind. So that's that's your lid. So that will fit in like, like that. So, yeah. Okay. And put all your pretty papers yeah. and everything so on there. So I leave that to 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 dry. How so long here's should one. we be leaving things to dry with MDF? <laughs> Um, it, depends it depends on the glue. On the glue. It yeah. does depend on yeah. the glue. If you've got a really quick grab, one an hour or two. Oh, okay. Um, I tend to if I'm going to use it for anything I, overnight. I tend to. It's not uh, a bad thing to do, is it? Or, actually, or, or yeah, one overnight. end of the day yeah. to the other. So yeah. no, that's fair enough. Right. So this is a. Quite a while, Extra actually. bit. <laughs> Extra bit in there. So this is um, a seven by five one. So this is the, the bigger the one. The next size yes. that was requested by your customers. Yes. So okay. and this one is it done exactly the same as that one. So I put them together. Lovely. So I'm going to put that together like that. So I'm now going to put the hinge on here. Oh, now, okay. The easiest way of doing that. Yeah. Is put it on its back like that. Right. Get some more of your tape. Okay. And tape that in position at the front, so you can line it up. Lovely. So just line it up like that. Perfect. That's for that one. I'll put the couple on the sides as well. Okay. And then just two on back down each side. It's nice as well because you can tear it. This um, is really yeah, good stuff, yeah. So and you can use tight. it more than once. I'm, I'm being quite oh, wasteful. To be honest, I am being quite wasteful. Well, you're allowed. But, you're but, allowed. Well, well, because it's on live TV, so you're allowed. <laughs> Sometimes <laughs> it's just as quick, isn't it? So. But you can, yeah, a couple of bits to do with the whole album. So you can put, it's great for putting the dies through. Yeah, every, see, anything like that. Yeah. Um, I've always got tape stuck to my, my different die cutting machines. I use yeah. it also on the sticky mats for the digital die cutting yeah. machines sometimes. So useful. So you get a strip of this, okay. and you usually get more than you need. Right. Okay, so you just need to trim this to size. So I'm just going to straighten that edge and up. Trim it before you take the backing off. Oh yes, definitely. Okay. Yes, <laughs> you'll be stuck to everything. everything yeah, we've all been it. there. But if you are new to this, <laughs> yes. Yeah, no, no, no stick it before you get to yeah, it. Yeah, definitely. That's it. Make sure it's nice and straight. All right, so I then I'm going to just go over there and then just kind of mark where you're going to mark where I'm going to cut it. It's just going to be there. Oh, it's a spring it is, but it's, it's that it. point on the the roll, isn't it? Where sometimes it's quite it yeah. springy. Right. Okay. So I'll just check that before I take the table off, and that. Fits there, okay. Lovely. We've got the space there. Okay. So then, peel it off now. Any tips with regards to this one? So you just peel it off. I bring it towards me. Maggie does it the other way around. Oh, okay, to separate the two yes. layers. Yes. Right. Yeah. So okay. it depends whichever way. You, obviously, I just do it. I find it easier for me. But yeah, Maggie does enough. it the other way around. So, so what you can do is do the butterfly technique. Oh, okay. So peel a bit off. Stick it back there. So now you've got, you can oh, do what you like with this I bit. See. You've only got a tiny bit of sticky to worry about. Right. So then you can just put this on here. That's going to be straight across. Lovely. So I'll just go that a little bit further. It's a little bit shorter, but that's fine. Because well, you've got pretty papers or paint yeah, or whatever to, to, you're choosing yeah, to decorate it with. So I'll show you how to just to edge, edge it with the um, pen.
our pens as well. Lovely. Okay, and just peel it off and go down. And that's a good point, actually, because if you're going for the pens, then if it's not quite exactly as you want it, I mean, as long as it goes over the hinge, because you're, you're only going to see a little tiny bit of it, yeah. aren't you, once you've decorated yeah. it. And then when you get to this point, you give it a good burnish, ideally with our Teflon tool. Oh, fabulous which, tool. Which did have a particularly good offer as, this morning, but it oh. went very quickly. Oh, did it? <laughs> yeah. They're brilliant. I've got one of these. I use it for um, kind yeah. of like the seam, seam finger pressing. Uh, yeah. 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 So I give that a really good burnish, and then you obviously take the tape off before you check the hinge. So you take it. So obviously I can use that and reuse that yes, again. Yes. Yeah. It's, it's still quite. It's, um, it's, it's sticky. quite sticky. And also it's it's nice because I've used reusable tapes. In a similar sort of scenario, but when you peel it off, it actually tears. Sometimes, so, this, does, this, yeah. sometimes this does, sometimes it doesn't. Yeah. It depends on how. how okay. So that goes on like that. So just peel that off. It's not leaving any residue at all. No, it doesn't. It? No, yeah. and you can turn on, on, on a lot of um, pack, most, most of the papers. Ready for decoration. Ready. Okay, just give it a good squidge, and that's it. And that is and that's it. so and that's, sturdy. That, yeah. That's the most nice sound, so I'll just... It back. does! <laughs> so, so you can use our pens. OK, so how would we use the pens? So you can use those to edge them. Right. So so this is the silver one. Now you're going to get... Is it all of them or is it a choice of? A choice of. Okay, you get one. So, so the um, gold, silver and gold are 8mm um, diameter pen thingy. Good chunky. Um, yeah, it's a good chunky. Yeah, yeah. It's not as chunky as the, the black, but it's a okay. good chunky one. And all you do is that, and it covers that well it's almost like a paint pen but it's just so easy and it just covers that well and you just go around like that and then if you wanted to so you go around like that. just that professional okay. finish doesn't it that? and then if you wanted to you can just go like that and then you'd have a, enough for, for a mat oh I so see. if you wanted to you just go around and, and just do each like that and you'd have a mat so then you just put your paper just yeah. inside yeah, of that. Yeah, it's just ah, inside of that. So that's, that's the silver one. And I'll just do the a little bit of the black one, because you've seen it covers well. But mm. you just literally, because that's a bigger chunk, chunky yeah. one. So that's a 15 mil. And that fits in like that. And then so again, if you want to do... So when you get them, I can hear there's a ball bearing, so you give them a shake yeah. and, and prime them as we've yeah, come yeah, across. Yeah, because yeah, 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 it comes out what, um, um, sort of a very pale colour. And okay. then you just pump them up and down until it comes... Look at the coverage, yeah. though, on the end I know, here. Yeah. <coughs> wow. Like that, not just one, that's just one sweep. Now, I believe that these are your um, end of call items, so when you come to check out your basket online, then they will be there, they'll be presented to you, which you can choose, and you can add them into your basket as you see, there you go, so you've got the black there, you've also got the silver, and of course the gold will be there somewhere. If you are placing your order on the phone lines, hopefully the call operators will suggest them to you, but if not, just ask them about them and they can get those into your um, basket as well. Um, so, uh, yeah, if you fancy getting hold of your 5 by 7 box, which obviously is the one that we've just seen um, Kay working with, she was putting together the original size, so there's two different sizes of those, but then you've got a third box that we've got made from MDF, which is your fabulous kind of memories box, So we're and th this sold out earlier right, on. Right, so we're, we're, we're putting this one together, okay. so you've got your lid, which is the, that one with a hole on it, Lovely. slightly smaller one, which is the inner lid with a hole in it, Okay. So I'm going to put, put a bit of glue, I'm going to use the bigger glue because it's a bigger area. Okay. So I'm going to squish a load of glue around. And again, I'm using the pit RPVA for this. I think it's ingenious, the little holes in there. That's okay. a really so, clever so, idea. Yeah, so you can either thread a piece and, have, and put a button through if you wanted yeah. to. So what I'm going to do is just put that to one side. Okay. Get myself, get myself a, a pokey tool or um, a needle or something. Put that through there. Put that on top. Then I know and that's a little better. hole. Right, and then just we'll just move that around. It's like having an extra pair of hands, isn't yep. it? That? And that's going to be straight and get it absolutely spot on. There you go. That was and that's that that easy. That is such a clever and then thing. Just, just wipe these off as you go around. Absolutely. And you can use a glue rubber if you want to, so hey? so we'll leave that to dry. Lovely. And, and I'm looking at the size and I'm guessing it's it's slightly smaller than a twelve by twelve, isn't it? So all those twelve by twelve papers that you've got, we're gonna be perfect for this. For, for decorating, yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. Yeah. yeah. So again, so what I'm gonna do here is obviously I'm gonna go to all the inner bits. Okay. I'll use this I'll use my Do tape. we need to use the tiger tape with this one as well? Yes, or? yeah, yep. so I've just saved oh, some, I, 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 did, I did actually <laughs> say I saved some from the last one, so they should all fit in there. So again, do this in one go. Don't don't think you can uh, leave it halfway through. You need yes. to do this all in one go. So okay, 
And again, so you've got four of the you got four of these to do. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to cheat a bit. Okay. And put them all together and, oh, and do them together. Oh, okay. I'll turn that around. That's it. Okay, so I'm going to. Well, that's clever. So you, can, you can you can do that if you wanted to. And without a safety okay. net, I love it. A professional so in there action. You go. <laughs> so, so you just need to make sure you just cover each one. Yes, yeah. Well, you need to make yeah. sure that, yeah, because obviously... Well, only because this is, quite frankly, it's watching like paint dry, but watching it put oh, these no. on. <laughs> well, I don't know what would go away, because it's, it's, like, it's interesting to see, and I know there'll be a lot of people that get frustrated if we kind of step away when you're part way through the demonstration. No, so. Right. OK, yeah. so they're, they're hopefully all glued together. And, of course, the flat edge is the, the, top, the top, so you don't yes. put any adhesive yeah, no, you on don't, there. No, you don't. So, okay. so, again, you put this on, so that one fits in like that. And we've got the little kind of okay, so I've got noggins. Inny there, so I want an outy <laughs> here. So that will go. We'll, we'll, and it just wiggle around until it fits. And is it, do you work your way kind of like yeah, just clockwise, or you don't do opposites? Make, or it make, doesn't matter. No, it doesn't make any difference. Well, I suppose think. when you know that they're engineered to perfection, it doesn't matter which order you put them in I'm, together. I'm not really, found it makes any there? difference particularly. Saying that, I'll show. Again, that fits in there like that. Oh, that one just needs a bit of a wiggle on that side. You've got a bit okay, there, there you go. Okay. So that would have been apparent when I got to the other end. So I can put my bit of tape just to keep that square. Perfect. And put the tape on here. They're so easy to come together, aren't they? Okay. And if you've got a special occasion coming up, or maybe you're just going through your photographs and your memorabilia. Um, and it's nice because you could actually have one for, I don't know, maybe you, you collect um, football programmes or something like that. Yeah. You could actually decorate yeah. it up with the, your team colours. Oh, yeah, they'd be lovely on the outside. And then, yeah, yeah you've got your programmes in the, in the centre and things like that. Yeah. Or a record or, collection, yeah. maybe you pop in records in there or tickets we'll go, for we'll, gigs that you've yeah, been to. Yeah, or go to yeah. the theatre and what have you. Yeah. And that is your box. As done. simple as that. How quick was that all to come together? So the other thing that I could have done before, before I put it together and I didn't mm -hmm. is use that our pen yes. and it could have gone around on the edge of this so let's turn it over oh because you've got so it if tight. i've gone on, on so if i've done now i've thought about it i've stuck it done now but if you've done that right so around then it would would that would just be black oh i see so that little tiny lip yeah. that you've got yeah there, that would just that be would black be, yeah yeah so no, okay. Again, yeah. again it's easy to think about these things after the end but now i thought about it you don't you, you now i've done it for you <laughs> so that is your memory box all and that comes is, together that is that simple Oh, I love it. Kelly, thank okay, thank you so no much. So interesting watching them all come together. So I love oh, well, that's how we design it, so it does come together quickly. That's it. That's <laughs> what it's all about. Now, are you guys going to be heading off to Don um, Doncaster later in the year? No, we're not. No, no, oh. we're not. We're not. We're not going to be at Doncaster it's this year. It's a bit year. further for you to travel. Isn't, isn't it? Well, it's a little way up the road, A1. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> um, but of course, we will be going there, and hopefully, you guys will be joining us. But you'll need a ticket to get in, and this is how you can get yours. Tickets are on sale now for Crafting Live at Doncaster Racecourse on the 15th and 16th of July, featuring exclusive offers and competitions. Sign up to free make and takes, stock up on your crafty goodies from a vast range of exhibitors and watch live guest demonstrations. We will also be broadcasting live, so join our audience and meet our presenters after the shows. Club members, order your tickets online to receive free entry. So, treat yourself or someone special to a great day out and book your tickets now at createandcraft.com and search for Crafting Live. We look forward to seeing you there. <laughs> We're giggling because literally with seconds to spare, <laughs> Kay's just come running past me like a crazy lady. You're right there. I'm fine. Yes, I'm fine. Fabulous. No running in the studio though. <laughs> no, 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 I was walking past. You were, exactly. Power walking. Um, now, we're going to head down and, and see Maggie in a few moments, but there's a couple of things that I need to tell you about before we get down there, including these fabulous stamps. And these are brilliant because you've actually got a collection of some fabulous little um, elements with regards to these as well. So these are brilliant. You're going to get um, your first set that we're looking at here. I'm just going to separate them up. So here you go. This is the one that we're looking at to start with. And this one is very much a travel themed. Now you're actually getting 49 stamps with these. So there's a lot within here. Some fabulous little phrases, lovely fonts as well. And they're really generic style fonts. So whether it's kind of um, a, a family trip that you're going on, or maybe it's kind of like a, a weekend away, it doesn't really matter the kind of uh, company that you're keeping when you're going away, you're going to find some fabulous fonts there that are going to work alongside it. You can see um, some little ideas of the, the fonts being used in different scenarios on the covers here. I don't know whether these actually come from that particular set. I don't think they do, but it gives you an idea of why it's important to have good stamps with your uh, memory project. So 
And there you go, that is your first set, 49 stamps there, um, entitled on our travel. So lots of things relating to, should I turn it to the side so you can read them a little better? There we go, let's turn that around there. So you can see there's loads and loads in there as well. I mean, there's a packy bag, so I mean, that could be used for any situation. <laughs> <laughs> Talking back to taking photos out of an album there. Um, just the ticket, off we go, grab your passport, all sorts of lovely little phrases there. And these are phrases that aren't easy to actually find a stamp for, but you're getting 49 of them in this set, £15.29, and pence. brilliant value for money um, and definitely a fabulous addition for any of those memory albums that you are creating. So 723106 if you fancy getting hold of that one. Next set that we've got for you and this is perfect for your memories and again I'm going to pop this one to the side. Oh actually no it's not too bad, they're all upright. So with this one, lots of the, the little kind of scenarios and the phrases that we saw on the front of the memory album a few moments ago are featuring within this set. Again a lovely set of different fonts, different styles in there for all sorts of different kind of themes that you're going to be creating. 17 stamps on this occasion, larger um, kind of fonts with some of these as well. So a brilliant one for the front covers of things. But again, you can use them for documenting your photos inside as well. So £15.29 pence if you fancy those. 725118 being the all important item number. And then we've got another little set at the end here. And these are brilliant because you know when you create something and you want to kind of give people clues as what they need to do. Well, these are the stamps and they're brilliant because they're just the right size. They're not kind of too overpowering because sometimes if you've created something, you don't want to distract somebody with a big sticker that says Paul here or something like that, do you? Well, with these, it's got the instructions there. Loads of different interactive tabs, as you can see, 26 of them, and invaluable, I think, when you are creating those interactive albums for people that might not be aware of how they work. Really clever idea, really good size. I like those a lot. And um, I've cut, actually, I think I've got, oh no, this is a different set that we've got at the back. So, shall I swap these around as we show you the last set? So, if you fancy getting hold of those, 487648. But the last uh, set of stamps that we've got to share with you, it's perfect for your journaling with regards to your photos. Every home should have a set of these because how many of us have got boxes and boxes of photos and we haven't got a clue who's in the photo? Um, and that's the thing with these, you've got the opportunity to document who's in the photo. This is a nice one as well if you're making your photo albums and selling them because of course you can do so. But again, people need to know where they're going to be putting the pictures. And sometimes it's one of those scenarios that they don't know that there's something that is lifting up or pulling out. So again, these are little kind of elements that you could be using for those perfect situations and again really hard to come by this kind of um, stamp set so 11 pounds and 69 pence very affordable you use that one over and over again so lots of products that we've been sharing with you but how do you shop for all of these goodies well you've got a few options might be that you're jumping onto the website and you're checking out what we've got on craft extra so if you go to the little calendar icon and this is at any time you like so you can click on there you can see what shows we've got coming up you can have a little look at other shows from previous days and all you need to do is click on the tab that says craft extra now obviously if it's a live show it will automatically or that, that particular time should i say it will automatically show you the products featuring within that show and it will also give you the opportunity to check out reviews if you so choose but on this particular occasion you will find all sorts of amazing projects to work with and fabulous tools that are going to help you with your crafting as well there's absolutely loads now these are relating to the products that we've got on the show um, and uh, we haven't had a chance to have a look at some of these items to be fair but you can always view um, other things that are on the brand section as well. So we're re referring to other bits and pieces as we've been going. So um, check it all out. There's a lot. And there it's is. lovely because we've yeah. kind of seen you grow from that first Yeah, from when Kay and I both show. used to demo yeah, for other people. Exactly, and then, yeah. Yes, yeah, it's really nice actually. Absolutely, but yeah. we couldn't have done it without everybody's help. So Aww, thank you guys. Yeah. And, all the family and yeah, everything. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. And, and you guys buying all the fabulous products as so. well. So what are we up to this time? Okay, right. So this is just to show you how big the photo wallet die is. Okay. So if you, this is a piece of A4 card. Lovely. Okay. And this is the die. Okay. So when you look at it, you can see that the cutting edge is... Oh, it's absolutely is, spot on, isn't yeah, it? Yeah. Yeah. It took a lot of them. We had, I don't know how many prototypes we had of this <laughs> die. Because we, we always... When we do any die design, we always have a prototype yes, before we yeah. go to full production. Sometimes, if we're lucky, mm -hmm. they're all good after the first one. We never know. Sometimes bonus, it, can take, it can take three or four 
prototypes because we, well, we are a bit OCD. Well, the thing is, sometimes so as well, you'll get a prototype and you suddenly think to yourself, well, actually, yes. you could do with adding that in. Yes, that, so, that's very yeah. true. Yeah. So I'm just putting so it so it's right on It's not that right it's a case it's not right, it's just it could be even better. That's it, yeah. But especially with like some of our, because we do interactive dyes as well, like our page slider dyes. Okay. They took a lot of time getting them. Quite a bit of engineering. And the same with the faux those, brads yeah. and things to make sure that everything is spot on. Right, so I've taped those two ends there. And what I would recommend then is also pop a bit just in the middle there. Okay. And then we'll just run through. Lovely. Now you're going to need um, one of your A4 you need, yeah. um, machines. We did do a little bit of measuring because I wasn't too sure about yeah, the width it, of this it one. It won't go and in. It was, too, yeah, it was slightly too, too wide. wide. So, uh, yeah, I think a lot of people have got the larger machines yeah. now anyway. So lovely. Um, do we have to consider the type of cardstock that we're working with, uh, the weight of it? Yes, probably because it's such a precision fit. You probably want um, a lower weight cardstock, probably 220, 240 probably. Okay. So none of your this kind of construction weight because of the well, folds and everything? No, but having said that, this is, I think this is 280, 290 that I've okay. cut here. But sometimes but we're looking at kind of in excess yes, of 300, yes. aren't we, with construction, no, that would be so too, that would be too much. That would be too much, so we'll and just take this off. And I suppose you're adding to the strength when you put your mats and layers on, yes, aren't you, you are. afterwards? Yeah. So, yeah. Yep. So that comes off there. Lovely. And again, that tape is brilliant. It's not leaving it's any brilliant marks tape, at all. Yeah. And you can write on it as well. So when I do oh, like... Okay. Um, album designs and stuff I quite often cut some paper out and I want to put a little notice on it afterwards so I just stick a bit of this tape on and, it's like a and little, um, little sticky reminder it is um, and of course the beauty is with these projects they're not meant to be quick projects they're no. projects that you're enjoying so, yes yeah. that's right so seven and they're sittings. also supposed to be projects that you know once you've done it you're really proud of what you've done yes. but also it'll they'll last they're not going to yeah, fall apart absolutely so and again i suppose that's something you need to consider yep. if you're working with photos make sure that your card stock's got yes. the archival yep. um and yep. uh, lignin free i think the phrase yes is, lignin it? free yeah. and i can see i didn't have it right on the edge there so okay. i haven't it wasn't on the edge of there but oh i thought i had one i'd cut earlier oh, it's, hold on is it under there so no it's all right no, so if that okay? happens you should be able to pop it back in the... Fair enough. Let's see if we can pop Jeez it back in. It's useful to know, actually, because if that situation arises when you're at home, then... Yeah, uh, yeah, it's really it's really annoying, and I know what happened because I didn't have the plates, cutting plates on it. Ah, OK. Does that make sense? Yeah, yeah. Yep, so just pop it back in. Bless you. Is that... Is that... <laughs> Am I That was a very delicate sneeze, yeah, wasn't it? she's a delicate it? girl, bless her. But she hasn't got your um, skill of um, stopping sneezing, know, has she? Yeah. Right, okay, so let's put that back on. Put that one underneath. On and there. again, when it comes to your platforms, I suppose it depends on which die cutting machine that it you does. use for the different... It does. Yeah, that's fair enough. Just check out the instructions, really, isn't it? As is the case with any die cutting when you're using a machine. If it feels like it's struggling, then just stop. Don't, don't yep. force it through. But, I mean, these are a, a traditional width, so... But you can issues. go through with a mang mangly yes, one yeah. normally as well, so it's fine. That's why it's making a bit of a clunk. Right, that's it. I suspect that's cut now. Lovely. Yes, that's cut there. That's fine. OK, so that is your base cut here. And that's... I mean, it's so economical, isn't yes, it? Yes, I mean, it is. Yeah. So we'll take that off, put that out of the way. So then we'll take... And you've got your fold lines on here. OK. So you just, I always do my fold lines first of all, just by hand, just to warm the fibres up That's and make tip. sure that, um, that you know, you have actually scored it, folded it straight yourself. Lovely. Um, just to give you a time check, we've got about okay. five minutes That's left. fine. Well, I'm just going to carry on with this. Uh, so that that one there. You could have a whole series of these ready, you can. couldn't you? Just have a, a mass die cutting session and then keep them all in a folder um, ready one of, when you um, need them. One of the cool cats um, made a whole load of photo wallets for his friend's wedding. Okay. So they had like a picture in and information like that. So again, oh. we're going to take take along the score line. That's a nice idea. And Just also as well, like you say, in, information, I mean, if you needed to, maybe you've got a, a party, you need to put a map yes. in there or yeah. something like that. I mean, you've got plenty of room. That's right. So you're really thinking ahead, aren't well, you? Well, these are okay, all so scenarios that's, that I've found myself in, to be fair. So, this so is that's welcome your to my world. base one like that. Okay. Okay. And I can see, looking at that, that's not burnished enough for me. So we just go back in and flatten it a bit more. Okay, okay. That's fine. Now, what you might find here, if your cardstock is really stiff and you have a job opening and stuff, just roll it in 
when you've made it up okay. like that. What you can also do is take your base and you can just very lightly with your Teflon tool just very lightly stretch it what at this stage yes okay because that just stretches the cardstock just a little bit That's a good tip and then you want to put your mats on top lovely so then this is your wallet that's opening out okay okay so i've got my pieces You've, here and this is the beauty of it because everything's positioned perfectly the dies yes. are spot on okay. for adding your detail so this is your flap that's going to fold over mm -hmm. so you want and that's my bit that's going to stick oh you can see already i've done it upside down right so this bit here your circle's pointing upwards so okay. i've got that the wrong way around oh i see yeah. so right can you yeah. see because you need to have that going the same so way around this is the point when you just do those visual checks yes of everything. you just need to take your time and think about it because okay. it's really annoying if you stick it on wonderful upside i'm going to get down. Kay to come and yep, join us fine. so she can come and say goodbye at the, at the end of the show because not a, a huge amount of time left but We've got an extra show. Three o'clock yeah. this afternoon. We have. The we have. Back, so. <laughs> so we can. Uh, we can. I can always finish this off. That's okay. Yeah. So we'll just carry on there. Pop that. And that's that one for there. And I know that's the right way round. We've still got a couple of minutes left. So All if right. You want to I'll pass carry, that I'll through carry you on. Yeah. Carry on. Yeah. Cutting. Carry on speeding. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Well, you can't there's, there's, no, there's no speed pressure. With this one. There's no, no pressure. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's, it's yeah, kind of enjoying the process. So <laughs> three o'clock. Um, what we've got coming up? Kay? Oh, we've got we've got hammer time at three o'clock. Hammer time. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to show you. To use the dimensional pocket as a frame, okay. And then uh, Maggie is going to do something with a hammer. Oh, fabulous! And we're yeah. learning so much from you, ladies. Three live <laughs> hours in one day. I mean, it is so fortunate. Love it. Um, and uh, yeah, of course, I mean, always popular hours, always. So, uh, yeah, we've been busy throughout. Lots of you have been placing your orders, but of course, you will still be able to place your orders between the two shows. So, if yes. you've got things in your basket, it's probably a good idea to actually check those out before yeah. we come back live at, um, at three o'clock. But that's over on the main channel. We'll all be done and dusted over here on Craft Extra at three. Oh, you're lucky. Will you be going home then? Do you want me to oh, that? I wish. No, I've only done one hour. <laughs> um, no, I've got another hour on Craft Extra with um, David. So, uh, oh, right. yeah. Okay. Some highlights. So, I'm going to pull yeah. that one out there. Lovely. And they're all perfectly oh. sized. See, this is the thing. You, you're not going to trace anything. You haven't got no, to you haven't. measure and anything. It's all it's designed all so it all, all works for you. So and that's it's, it's that one things there. Things like getting the actual slots in the right place. Because if you're doing that manually, <laughs> that, that's why we had so many prototypes. Yeah, it's going to come together perfectly. <laughs> okay, so it? that's going to go on there, and that's going to go on there, like oh, that. that. Looks fabulous. So stick that one that on there. Uh, that no, that one no, needs no, to yeah. be cut. That's okay. okay. Well, I won't peel it off then. Well, we've only got a minute. Oh yeah, she'll be in trouble if you do. We've only got a minute or so left, so we'll probably get this paper on, mm. and then uh, maybe see the story continue in the next time. <laughs> okay, so. right. So that's that bit. Perfect. There, like that. Just wiggle it a bit so it's right. And you need to burn it really well. Okay, so that's the first part. And then that will come round of your wallet, and that slots in there like that. Perfect. And then obviously you've got the die for the inner detail. What I did then, I took the. This is one that cuts out the actual rectangle. I don't think we've got time to cut we're it, have not. we? We've only got about 15 seconds oh, right, or so. Okay. Yeah, just yeah, right. that's cut out <laughs> and then you can put that as on there. It's got the cutting Perfect. slots to put your pictures in I as well. I love it. But we'll chat about that a little bit later on. It okay. won't be me though at three o'clock. <laughs> so uh, yeah, well, make sure you tune in main channel three o'clock. The ladies will be back. Thank you. Hello, my name's Kay from Indigo Blue and together with my husband Alfie, we design and manufacture our own in-house red rubber stamps. We also have our own range of paints, luscious and stencils. We're so proud that we've now got a reputation for such high quality products and the detail that we can manage to get in our stamps. I get to demonstrate lots of different techniques for you to understand how to use our products and hopefully inspire you. I've got loads of fantastic ideas buzzing around in my head so I can't wait to get those filtered into our products and out to you at home. So grab a cup of tea, join me and the team from Indigo Blue. I'm Trisha from So Totally Trisha.
I've been sewing since I was about eight years old. I carried on through my teens, and when I had children, I've sewn for them. And now I love nothing more than to design fabric-based kits for patchwork, for bags and home decor. My kits use quality fabrics and are normally cut to size so that it makes everything easy for the beginner sewer and the more advanced stitcher to be able to make beautiful designs. All the fabric I use is 100% cotton and top, top quality. On my shows, I hope that you can learn from my hints and tips and every one of my kits is like a workshop in a kit. Make sure you don't miss the Sew Totally Trisha shows. Hi, I'm Abs from Orient Create. I've been crafting for over 10 years now and I love stamping, stenciling, creating layers, colors, textures and creating depth and dimension. Orient Create was established in October 2016, collaborating with a group of designers and artists from all over the world, bringing different designs and products in different styles. We proud ourselves of high quality photopolymer clear stamp sets, dyes, stencils, washi tapes and acrylic blocks, all in different size and formats. I hope to bring you inspiration and different ways of using your craft products. Make sure you don't miss the Oland Create shows. Hello there and welcome back. Welcome back to an hour that I'm very much looking forward to because I'm working with David. Obviously, it's an hour <laughs> to look forward to. Thank but you. also, we've got a fabulous deal that you've been we sharing do. with everybody. Your pick of the week. Absolutely. And it's been a very popular deal. It has indeed. And I think one of the reasons mainly for that as well, this USB really does go back to the grassroots of Minecraft Studio, where it covers all bases. Everything is included for you. And, you know, this is the most amount of content I've actually bought 